Hello guys, welcome back to another video. So today we have got a brand new update inside of Roblox Islands. And in this update, we have some new tools, what I'm going to be covering. But before I start this video, can we get to 10,000 subs by the end of this month ago? Drop a sub, and now let's get shown to this video. So basically, what Roblox Islands has added is two new tools. The Greg's Hammer and the Forge Hammer. I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. Not really sure if that's correct or not. You're probably curious on how you can actually craft them. Well, you can craft these in the Tier 4 Workbench. So... If you go to the tier 4 workbench, go to tools, scroll down a bit, all the way to the end, you can see that you can craft these two for two enchanted diamonds, 30 steel plates, and 20 pine wood. And that is the exact same for both of them, but we're going to go over Greg's hammer first. So Greg's hammer can destroy up to nine blocks at once. If you click, you can destroy it really fast. And then if you want to go ahead and build things, this is what the forge hammer is meant for. So you need to have the block placed in order for this actually to work. So what that kind of means is say if I want to build out of black clay, I kind of have to build a strip like this firstly, and then it will work. And if I don't have that, it will just build off the block it is facing off. But this is a seven times one radius. So we can go ahead and build as much as you want. So if you're a builder, this is an update for you. But Basically, the Forge Hammer is for building, and the Greg's Hammer is to destroy. And another thing what a lot of people do not know is that there is a new rotation system. So, say I wanted to place a block right here. Look how there's a new rotation system. It used to just snap before, but now you can actually see the way it's rotating. So, that's just another hidden feature what hasn't really been noticed. So, they have increased the rate of spawning the enchanted diamonds for around a week so go grind core for a little bit this week and you should be able to get these enchanted diamonds quite fast and there is another new feature so as you all know if i wanted to get this marble block out it is a pain to go into my inventory type marble and then pull it all out but there is a new way to actually get these blocks out so say for example i wanted to get this purple glass out all i have to do on pc is click the middle mouse button and then it will auto equip that block what i was pointing at but yeah, for mobile, if you want to be able to do that, that is a icon on the hopper, so it should be somewhere down here. And then the on controller is L2 or LT, not really sure about that. But yeah, that is basically how you can do that on other devices. But now we're going to go to the hub, and you want to head all the way over to the block sky. And then if you go to the block sky and go into his shop and scroll down around halfway, you should see two new blocks, the thorn block and the mud block. And they are both 35 coins each, so it's quite cheap. But these blocks are not like your normal blocks. And I'll explain that right now. So if we go back to my island and we place these blocks, and these blocks you can actually walk through. So the mud blocks makes it so you will get this effect and you actually slow down. And there's another hidden feature with that, even if it is dropped, it will still slow you down. So you just have to be touching it for it to slow you down. And then we have the thorn block, what will do damage over time. But it's kind of useless since you kind of just auto heal by the time it's doing two damage, so. But like these blocks can be very troll-like, so you can spawn, like, spawn camp a whole bunch of people and stuff like that. But yeah, then we have a new industrial truffle bucket so it's kind of just like so the pigs can go up to it and drop their truffles off it like it's the exact same thing like the um industrial milk cup as you can see you can find the industrial truffle barrel right here where it'll just drop it up there and go into a conveyor and there is another thing what it has added to the industrial milker where you can actually hold up to two milk i'm pretty sure like increase the size slot i'm not really sure about that fix privacy uh setting not displaying for players and potato prices have risen from 11 to 17 and carrot prices have dropped from 21 to 17 and farmer cletus has been whispering about onions but yeah, let me know what you guys think of this update in the comments. And if you want to know some tips and tricks about vending machines, click right up here. And I'll see you next video or live stream YouTube. And now, goodbye, YouTube. <laughs>